India finds some Chinese coronavirus testing kits are only 5% accurate and scraps order for half a million of them, including one faux brand already rejected by Britain. Kits produced by Guangzhou Wunfo Biotech and Zuhai. Lives in Diagnostics, intended to return results in 30 minutes and to test for virus antibodies, Wunfo Biotech is producer of a test which was rejected by UK government. India has scrapped an order for half a million coronavirus testing kits from China after they were allegedly found to have just a 5% accuracy rate. Some of the faulty kits were already in use in several states but have now been withdrawn by the country's government. The rapid testing kits take around 30 minutes to return a result and are intended to detect antibodies in people who may have already had coronavirus. They were reportedly produced by Chinese firms Guangzhou Wunfo Biotech and Zuhai Lives and Diagnostics, according to Indian news outlet NDTV. Wunfo Biotech is also the producer of an antibody test which was recently rejected by the British government for not having a high enough accuracy rate. Officials in a number of Indian states reported an accuracy rate of just 5.4% for the tests and found they were returning negative results for people who they knew had had the virus. It is unclear from reports which of the two tests was shown to have such a low accuracy rate. China has disputed India's claims about the quality of the tests. Chinese embassy spokesman Ji Rong told the BBC on Tuesday, the quality of medical products exported from China is prioritized. It is unfair and irresponsible for certain individuals to label Chinese products as faulty and look at issues with preemptive prejudice. However, the BBC said the kids had also failed checks done by the Indian Medical Research Council ICMR. The tests were imported after several Indian states pushed the ICMR to allow them because of concerns that not enough people were being tested. Officials have since told local media that the government will not lose a single rupee from cancelling the huge order because they had not paid in advance. India has now reported 29,451 coronavirus cases, with 939 confirmed deaths. On Monday, it emerged the British government had rejected a test produced by Onefo Biotech. It was found to have an 82 percenter accuracy rate at identifying people who have had the disease according to scientists in the U.S. They tested it independently and found it could correctly identify 81 out of 100 people who had had COVID-19 in the past, and would give fewer than 1 in 100 false positives among people who hadn't. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for new videos.